Okay, so I took apart two of the exact same camera, and I, I did it, to be honest, because I had uh, some issues getting... I took the first one apart to identify the parts inside of it, and had some issues getting it back together because some of the screws just were stripped and, and it, it wouldn't would, did not want to go back together. And so uh, I bought another one and found out something kind of interesting. So this camera, and a lot of products go through different revisions that don't necessarily show up in model numbers. Uh, so that means that the uh, manufacturer may have found a better way or a less expensive way to produce something. and uh, Or it could be that they just found a cheaper way to produce something and were able to improve their, their margins. And so with this camera being so low cost, I'm sure the margins are very uh, of a great deal of interest to the to the manufacturer. If you look, this this one says uh, version 3.8, and this one says version 3.3. So this is an older version. This version has an epoxy potted uh, central processing unit or CPU, and this one has a uh, just a plastic cover over it. So the plastic cover it may not be as robust as the epoxy potting. I'm not sure but it doesn't doesn't look quite as, as stable you know it'd be harder to mess up those wires and when I pop this off the wires are clearly messed up to the uh, C, C, uh, CPU there and um, if you know, obviously the boards are totally different colors I guess that uh, lets the uh, manufacturer know that there are different revisions if you uh, flip the flip the boards over you can take a look at the uh, let me zoom in just a little bit on this you can uh, see the the charged couple device or the light capturing de device is uh, very different. So this one looks larger, more robust. This one looks a lot smaller. So it, it, it appears that what they've done is, is a cost reduction, um, probably a reason to change. Also the onboard memory is a different manufacturer. So it may be that this memory is uh, less expensive, the new memory. Uh, this board doesn't need this capacitor. And so uh, perhaps this, this uh, electrolytic capacitor was a cheaper way of storing a charge um, to, during the uh, photo process. And if you look at the lenses here, um, this one's got a big uh, you know, lens cover over it, and this one has no lens cover over it. So that probably added cost. I don't believe that's actually the lens. I think it's still that tiny little thing that you see inside this one here. Um, but it looks bigger with that and they probably just got rid of it to uh, to reduce cost so anyway that's the difference between difference between the uh, the first or one, one of the earlier iterations and one of the later iterations but as far as consumers go you wouldn't know any difference at all when you bought the two cameras because they're they're virtually identical on the outside